October the 11th saw the once fresh-faced Ikioi turn 34 years of age. He's never missed a bout in his 15-year career, and proud of it, but recent showings suggest his first default has to come soon, and may also be his last. September 2020 saw the lively Osakan post just three wins for the second tournament running. Last time in Division 1, this time in Division 2. Add in his final weekend defeats in March, and we have a combined recent record of 26 losses from 32 bouts. We thought he was over his struggles with ankle problems and cellulitis at the end of last year, when he became Division 2 champion in September and runner-up in November. But since July, he's barely looked able to walk. Perhaps he fooled even himself with his excellent opening day rope work against Kotoyuki. Awareness and positioning masking his total inability to withstand frontal attacks. Only Kotoyuki's poor sideways movement saved him on this occasion. He was not so lucky though against Yuki's stablemate Kotonowaka on day two. Once the youngster's arms get inside, there's nothing the veteran can do, no matter how scrunched his face becomes with the effort. The changing of the sumo guard continued on day three, with Ikioi's defeat to 25-year-old Wakamoto Haru. Turning and resisting were well beyond that painful-looking right foot of his. It would actually be day nine until he won again. Daisho Maru, the rare victim. The intervening days, including these two defeats, I got on camera. In the first of these, on day five, you can really hear his grunting cries of anguish. In the second, on day six, after several failed arm lock throws, he feels something go in his left foot. He became but the latest fine wrestler to be described by sports writers as injured all over. Days 10 and 11 yielded further defeats, leading into this day 12 affair with another cellulitis sufferer, Tsurugisho. His face shows just how hard his upper body is trying to compensate, and how let down he feels by his legs. A sympathetic bouts committee thus paired him on day 13 with the only man doing worse, winless Orki. Even then, Ikioi feared direct impact, and needed three follow-throughs after the initial sidestep. As the highest ranked man in Division 2, he was asked to join the Division 1 program for the final weekend, losing to Ishiura with the bad ankle on the Saturday, and finishing on the Sunday against a Shohozan weakening with age.
full marks for fighting spirit and fighting instinct, for those legs of his can neither be relied upon for tactics nor sudden changes of movement. We know he has held the Kasugayama Elder Stock since 2017. He's fought over a thousand consecutive bouts, won two second division titles, claimed four fighting spirit prizes and five gold stars. He can retire at any time and enjoy job security for 30 plus years in the coaching ranks. So why doesn't he do it? That's a question I suspect only a professional sumo wrestler can answer.